Okay, we're going to solve this complicated looking equation which has got two sets of brackets within it, one on the left hand side and one on the right hand side of the equals. The first job is to get rid of the brackets by expanding out those brackets. Okay, here we go then. Well, first of all, we've got six, take away three lots of the bracket. The six goes straight down. You do not work out six take three is three and then say three lots of the bracket. The six goes straight down and what you've got is then take away three lots of the bracket. So we say negative 3 times 4 is negative 12. We then say negative 3 multiplied by negative 3x. A negative times a negative is a positive. So you get plus 9x. Notice you've got a minus in the bracket, but you've got a positive when you expand it out because of the negative in front of the bracket. Equals. The right hand side also needs expanding out. So you've just got two lots of the bracket. So it's 2 times x is 2x, and then 2 times positive 1 is positive 2. So I've now eliminated both brackets. Let's tidy up a little bit on the left-hand side, because on the left you've got two numbers, 6 minus 12, which can go together. 6 minus 12 is a negative 6. Plus 9x equals a 2x plus a 2. I'll leave that unchanged on the right hand side because that can't simplify. I've got x's on both sides. Which side's got most x's? Well I've got a positive 9 on the left, I've got a 2 on the right. So that means there's more x's on the left. So I'm going to collect the x's on the left. So I'm going to leave the 9x on the left. Now it doesn't swap sides, so it doesn't swap sides. So it remains as a plus. If it's the first thing I write down, I can drop the plus from in front of it. So 9x. I'm going to take that 2x from the right hand side to join it on the other side. Well that 2x has actually got a plus in front of it even though you can't see it. If you take it to the other side it swaps sides, it swaps signs. It becomes a minus 2x. Equals. The numbers go the other way. It doesn't matter which one I put down first. The 2 or the 6 makes no difference. The plus 2 is already on the right hand side. It doesn't swap sides. It doesn't swap signs. It remains as 2. Plus can be dropped because it's the first thing I'm writing down. I now take the minus 6 and I drag that to the other side to join it. Minus 6, swap sides, swap signs, becomes plus 6. So on the left hand side now I tidy up. 9x's take away 7, sorry, 2x's gives 7x's. And on the right hand side I've got 2 plus 6, simplify that and you get 8. So we've got 7x's are equal to 8, but I don't want 7x. I want to know what x is. So what I'm going to do is share that by 7 to get x. So I take the 8 and I share that by 7 as well to keep it balanced. 8 over 7 is not a nice whole number, so I'm going to leave that in fraction format. x equals 8 sevenths is the answer to this equation.